Hey guys, what's up? This is Crash, and today we're gonna play some Ganesh Impact on the IQ Double O Z Three Five G. So this is one of the most interesting in the animated game we have right now in the in the Play Store, I believe, because I think Ganesh Impact is also released for the PlayStation. And same for the Xbox, if I'm if I'm not wrong, but I'm sure about the PlayStation though. So it's a big thing that this game is finally on a mobile device, mobile device, and I'm really excited for it. So I thought of making a video for it and how does it perform on the IQ Z3. It is also not only for the IQ Z3. Like you guys can have a like you know sort of uh, a vision how this game actually does. So. I'm gonna let you know that my ultra gaming mode is turned on and also I have a, like on turn on my do not disturb so we don't get any notifications between most of the time we do get but there is but there is no pop-up sound so let's get started to the game and how does this perform so let's play and I'll let you know my detailed review in between as well so let's go Okay, I think it's sticking. Okay, we hold you. Can I show back? Okay, just a minute. I'll just log in by the time. Just give me a So, here are the terms and conditions. I'm logged in and let's see what this game holds. Let's go. Select server, Asia. crash that's fine okay I'm gonna skip this no need to worry I'm gonna skip this huge download that is almost 1.2 GB so I'm gonna skip this so guys was wrong. it was not 1.2 GB it's a massive 12 GB download once you download the game from the app store it was huge download I didn't expect that <laughs> I think like this is going to be one of the one of the I think it was gonna be the biggest game in the Play Store that is available as of now because I have never seen a 12 GB download in my entire life and especially downloading it from Play Store and that's that's just a mobile game I didn't expect that so our 12 GB download has been done and definitely this is not recommended for the mobile data users so if you have a broadband connection then it's a good to go or if you have like unlimited data like a postpaid plan then go ahead download it because uh, I think that was one hell of a download <laughs> I'm, st I'm still shocked that it's a 12 GB so but it was supposed to because this game is a PlayStation game as well so I like expected it to be a big download but not 12 GB I expect something like 4 like 2 3 to 4 GB anyways we'll further continue and let's see what this game holds for us and how the graphics are does the game plays really smooth on the IQ double O Z three five G and also my variant is eight GB Y one twenty eight GB. Also, if you do see this video, guys, it is not only specifically for IQ. Uh, you guys can like have the similar specification like my phone, so definitely it will perform the same on the country, like same wise on your device as well. And I'm gonna say the music is really beautiful. It's really amazing, especially with the with the scene like. What I'm seeing right now in front of my screen. This looks beautiful with the music. So I think it's very fine file integrity. It's really long. Finally, we are done. Oh my god. So guys, I'm gonna pause it again. I don't know how much time will it take. I'm sorry for that. So I'll pause it again and make sure it gets gets done as soon as possible. So in the game all the loading is done 
and let's see how this begins because it's already over and I have to wait 5 minutes without wasting any more delay just, just let's just jump right in the game hmm. really can't to improve your gaming experience I'm already on so what you're trying to say is that you fell here from another world But when you wanted to leave and go on to the next world, your path was blocked by some unknown god? Outlanders, your journey ends here. Who are you? The sustainer of heavenly principles. The irrigation of mankind ends now. Okay, so we gotta select a twin. Okay, so I think we'll go with the male because we are the male. <laughs> we'll go with him on the right side. And your name. Just like that, a god took away my sister. Some kind of seal was cast upon me, and I lost my power. So while we used to travel from world to world, we are now trapped here. Okay, so those animations for just you good. How many years ago was it? I don't know, but I intend to find out. When I woke, I was all alone, until I met you two months ago. Yeah, Paimon really owes you for that, otherwise Paimon likely would have drowned. So Paimon will do her best to be a great guy. We should head off. Let's get going! Guys, I'm telling you, this is one hell of a game for a movie there is. Please press and drag to the camera. Okay. Tension and all good. Okay. Fine. Use a joystick to move. Tap and hold to so for now the game is going to be smooth. So yeah, what is this? Okay. The combat is smooth as well. So I need to like to zoom in a little bit. Yeah, that's good to me. Okay, what is that? Some code book. Open the world max metal unlocks will be a point to go to that location. Okay. Follow the mini map to your destination tab Okay, so we are still right there. So I think we are supposed to follow that. This is the instruction right here. Of 
depletes stamina, and depleted stamina takes time to recover. Okay, let's take the route we planned. We're off to a statue of the seven. Which of the seven are you looking for exactly? So guys, the visuals are really amazing. And I think it's an open world game, so you have a lot of content to do. So probably it's gonna be a lot of fun. Oh, wow! controls the wind. Paimon's not sure whether the god you're looking for is the animal god, but... Paimon will take you to the animal god's place first, and there's a reason why. Prologue and the other learning called the wind. As we all know, poetry and language flow like the wind. There'll definitely be someone there who knows about your sister. At least that's what Paimon thinks. Whether the gods actually answer you is a different story. You never know unless you try. So let's hop to it. <sighs> that's, a, that's a cute little voice. And I think guys, we will go and check out the graphics. But it looks phenomenal for, for a moment. Guys. And I have, I'm gonna say this, for the IQ level Z3, it's not lagging at all. Even if it's a cinematic or it's the gameplay that we are playing right now. So I think that is completely fine. It works, it looks perfect. You can swim right over! Okay, so for everything you do, you lose stamina. That's pretty realistic. Okay, so we just unlock the map that is the star fell valley and we will have a lot of things to do so we are at the star fell lake for now okay oh did you just feel the elements of the world seems all you had to do was just touch the statue and you got the power of animal as much as they may want it people in this world can never get a hold of powers as easily as you i think i know why uh-huh. It's because you're not from this world to begin with. If we keep heading west from here, we'll eventually reach Mondstadt, the city of freedom. Mondstadt is the city of wind because they worship the god of Animo. So perhaps because you got power from the god of Animo, you can find some clues there. There are also lots of bards there, so perhaps one of them has heard news of your sister. Let's move then. The elements in this world responded to your prayers, and Paimon thinks that's a lovely sign. Okay. That's a super power. So, like, when in the when there is a cutscene, or like, uh, wait a second. Okay, so, you just find uh, an autoplay option on the left side of the screen. So you just click that and it will be automatic. Um, so you don't need to press to go past the screen every time you need to. So we need to like uh, play the movie. So where we need to go? Okay, are you supposed to kill all of them? Wind blade! Wind blade. Okay, 
here we are supposed to head oh, the city of freedom right we are supposed to go there Okay, okay. I see, I see. I'm so sorry. I'm in Sarah. I see. I see. These are the animal powers you got from the Statue of the Seven. Oh, Paimon's so jealous. Why doesn't Paimon get cool fighting powers? What is this? Uh, well, okay, that's the news. Never mind. And did we just summon the farmer? Open the news. <sighs> okay. So we have this reward. We have no hair, no item, it's empty. It's new. What is this? This is sweeping. Medallion, please show them to you of the max HP and additional to the selected characters. I see. Okay. <clears throat> Good remote. No, sir. Okay. So, like if you click on it, it will directly take you. So, I just now forget a little bit now. A very low map. Open this. And yeah, now I'm trying to. I'm a little bit mad, but it's still very close. What is that? That's a common chest. I'll keep this close. Wow! What is that? There's something huge in the sky! It's headed towards the heart of the forest! We must proceed with caution. Because the Indian music is it's really beautiful. <laughs> what no? Yeah! Wind blade! Yeah! That's fine. Huh? He didn't attack me, but he comes near me to get himself killed. That's fine. Okay, so I can climb the tree as well. Man, man. Hmm. 
It definitely has something to do with that weirdo who was talking to the dragon. Yeah, Paimon gets why you're worried. Oh, what's that? There's some kind of shiny red thingy on the big rock over there. Let's go take a closer look. Be careful. Paimon doesn't have a good feeling about this. Not us. Not me. <laughs> Paimon's never seen a stone like this before, so Paimon can't tell what it is. All Paimon knows is that it's dangerous. Best we put it away for now. Okay, we've got it. Now let's get out of here. <laughs> Three. Also, guys, if you want, you do check out my previous video. I have uploaded some racing, like S Flat 9 Legends, and Rebel Racing, and other things as well. Hey, you! Stop right there! Hey, Paimon! Stop right there! Stop right there! May the Animo God protect you, stranger. I am Amber, outrider for the Knights of Favonius. You don't look like citizens of Mondstadt. Explain yourselves. Well, we're not looking for trouble. That's what all the troublemakers say. Doesn't sound like a local name to me. And this mascot, what's the deal with it? I mean, we've only been traveling partners for two months, but... We've already become the very best of friends. So to sum it up, you're traveling partners, right? Well, look, there's been a large dragon sighted around Mondstadt recently. Best you get inside the city as soon as possible. It's not far from here. I'll escort you there. Oh, aren't you out here for some other reason? I am, but not to worry. I can keep you both safe while doing that too. Besides, I'm still not sure if I can trust you two just yet. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. Probably not something I should say as a knight. I give you my apologies, uh, strange yet respectable travelers. That sounded so fake! <laughs> Do you have something against the type of language usage prescribed by the Knights of Havonius Handbook? Oh guys, I'm telling you, like this, like this animation of the new character, it looks so beautiful. It looks so beautiful. As an archer, Amber is an ideal for taking down target from a distance. Tap Amber for take to switch to her. Okay, we can switch. Amber. Tap to enter aiming mode. Tap again to exit aiming. Okay. Hold Amber attack button to enter aiming mode. So, suspicious travelers, what are you doing in Mondstadt? He got separated from his sister during a really, really long journey. Paimon is his travel buddy, helping him to find his sister. Oh, looking for your family? Huh. Uh... Okay, let me finish my other stuff first, and then I can help you put up posters around the city. What exactly is it you need to finish doing first? It's simple. You'll understand in a bit. Uh, I gotta say... This is... I didn't expect it, like, and also guys, like, while I'm playing this game, I forgot, so... This game doesn't lag at all for the IQWZ3 and I think if you have a similar specification device, I think it should not lag. And as far compared to the heating, now I've already played it for 25 minutes. So you can notice a little bit heating uh, on the device. Uh, but it's okay, you won't find it too much. It's a, it's, it's a minor one. Uh, a hilly turtle! Look for the objective in the same way. Go, go, Baron Bunny! Any 
switch monsters? These monsters have been getting too close to the city recently. My task this time is to clear out their camp. So I might say this, uh, as I said this earlier, uh, you will feel a, a little lag while playing the game, I'll say that again. But it, this game is really cool though. <laughs> Can we jump on a chair? No. Uh, we gotta switch the character and we're gonna attack. A little with your moves there. Thanks for the backup. How'd it feel? Barely broke in a sweat. Those things are tougher than you. Now that you mention it, how is it the hilly trails ended up here? These creatures don't seem like the type to set up camps so close to cities like this. Exactly. It's more normal for them to be much further out in the wilderness. But because the dragon, Storm Terror, has been around a lot more recently, our orchards have been destroyed and the local market has been affected as well. When the storms hit, we usually end up with at least a few injuries, so the Knights of Favonius have been tied up doing the best they can to defend the area. So these annoying creatures have been getting closer and closer to the city? Exactly. That said, clearing this camp helped make the area a little bit safer. Come with me. A responsible knight must make sure to see you to the city safely. Okay. So we are going upon the breeze. So I hope guys you liked my gameplay though. I'll be calling out the video now. Wow, these will come in handy. So, but for me, I'll just give my final reviews to the game. It's really amazing game. It's an open world game. You will spend like hundreds of hours playing this game and finding out new objectives, new adventures and everything. And it's a really beautiful game. Also, if you're playing on a Snapdragon 888, I think it's going to be a much it's going to be a really complete smooth experience for you folks the higher the processor the, the higher the performance but on the iq 3 i said it's a very minor lag you don't have to face much issues you can completely play this game and spend thousands of hours playing on the device uh, without without any complaints uh, much complaints i as uh, that's what i mean but it's it's really cool to uh, you know have such games on a mobile device like I said earlier like it's a PlayStation game I believe it might be on PC and Xbox as well not sure but yeah it's one of the games that uh, people were anticipated to have this on a device on a mobile device so guys if you want to try if you want to play uh, definitely if you have a broadband connection go ahead and download this game you have a massive 12 GB to download that will download all the resources and you will get one of the best experience of the games that have been ever developed on the mobile <sighs> so like the visuals are amazing everything is just amazing it looks like, like a switch game but it's amazing I hope guys you enjoyed my video if you did enjoy my video leave a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel also if you have any suggestions for the future do let me know and this is not only for the IQWZ3 as I'll repeat again if you have like uh, a similar compatible similar specification device definitely it will run smooth and also this gameplay was uh, on turn my ultra gaming mode was turned on I believe uh, yes the ultra game mode was turned on and uh, it works perfectly fine just where you will, you will find like a very minute uh, lag while playing the game so that is all my review and I think it's almost like uh, half an hour like it's been 29.40 minutes we have been recording this 
and yes so for me it's a definitely a good to go go ahead and download this game if you love the open world game you like to explore more <laughs> there is no problem with it mm. definitely a must go game so i hope guys you liked it and this now i'll be calling out the video please stay safe take care along with your family and i hope this might have helped you to get to how this game looks like and how this game feels like so this is crash guys i'm calling it out bye bye take care stay safe see you in the next one